Howdy, y'all. On my way to, uh, well, I'm just south of Birmingham, 30 minutes from my destination, after coming all the way from Monroe, Louisiana. And, uh, 30 minutes from the destination, and these storms made a tree fall over and block both lanes. I'm pretty sure it was probably lightning, because it was a ridiculous amount of lightning. And the tree doesn't look old. But, uh, Hopefully, they'll get this moved sooner than later. Some woman came up quickly right to there, wearing a dress and jumped out. I ran across into the ditch to the other side. So I hope everything's okay with them. Reporting live somewhere just south of Birmingham. <laughs> okay. What are we gonna do now? What are we gonna do now? I would just turn around except that it's kind of in the middle of the no in the middle of nowhere. And uh and it looks like Maybe the cops want me to back up a bit. Kind of in the middle of nowhere and I imagine by the time I find an alternative route, they will have already cleared it. Yeah, they already, it looks like he's starting up a chainsaw, yep. Man in the yellow, oh, I guess she went to get her, her boy. Rama Badalom is a captured salot. Oh, it's free and <laughs> Yes, I am. And you too. <laughs> Man, wouldn't that not be pleasant? Wouldn't that be unpleasant to uh, fall on you as you're just driving along? I think we'll be getting through here sooner than expected.
I'd go out there and help them, but I'm pretty sure they don't want me to do that. Kind of like stacking those plates after eating at a restaurant, right, Mom? I gotta tell you, I saw some awesome cloud formations as I drove through multiple tornado warning areas. Really. I didn't see any, like, explicit, highly defined funnel cloud, but I saw, I saw lots of clouds, like, doing things that I've not seen before. <laughs> like, clouds on the ground and I'm not talking about fog, they're clouds, and they were on the ground, but not connected to the sky with a funnel. And some of them were kind of like gently going around, but not, not anything crazy. Maybe they were like nescient tornadoes, proto-tornadoes, who knows. But they were definitely tornadoes because they were talking about it on the radio. I encountered it, um, both around Jackson, then around the Mississippi, Alabama state line, and then a little bit further into Alabama. It's probably all the same cell. And I also saw when it wasn't raining, there was a point where no rain was hitting the car, but like I could see outside would look like just statically suspended bands of rain right around me. Strange. And also one thing looked like a clearly rotating um, cloud, which was enormous, but it was lower than all the rest of the clouds. Um, but it was horizontal and not vertical. And it was huge, 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 huge. Maybe that was like a potential tornado if the draft had just been such to make it come down. It was really, it was pretty cool, pretty cool, y'all. I, I love tornadoes, as long as they're not killing anybody, you know. They don't have to kill someone. As long as it's not right on top of me. A few times I was like, what's the stuff going on around me here? Anyway, keep watching the lumberjacks. Oh, so I, multiple trees, because they they already took apart one. Cola cavo. Is a mega virzaya. Or she's a shav. And the other one is a mega There was so many lightning strikes. It was it was pretty incredible. I had not seen that many lightning strikes constantly, consecutively, uh, more than that in my life, except for like a year and a half or so ago in the Tampa area, riding with you, Mr. Patrick. Remember that? Remember that? Coming home from Planet Fitness? That was like something out of an action movie or video game where it was like we were virtually dodging lightning bolts. That was crazy. It wasn't that bad. But it was next in line. I think I'm gonna uh, retire now from videography and proceed listening to a video I'm listening to on inspiring philosophy on YouTube, talking about the uh, mistakes literal six-day creationists make 
regarding the book of Genesis. Pretty cool. Haven't heard it all yet. But that's what we shall do now. Yalla bye. Adonai Shmerechem. And now that they've cleared away the trees, what have we here? More trees. So, I don't think that's a coincidence. No. Either there were just like a coincidence of multiple strong enough lightning things to knock down trees, three trees at least, they cleared away these two that were right here, and now there's another one maybe 60 feet past it. So it's either lightning or maybe just a weak tornado or or really, really strong gusts. Near, nearly tornado thingies, who knows. But like my mom said, I'm glad I got here just after it instead of right when it happened because I got here pretty fresh. Oh gosh, I thought I was about to get going and another one. I hope there aren't any more after this. I mean, I... oh well, it's a little entertainment. Flooding. This, I had to go around several Turn right times. onto 2nd Street, then your destination will be on the left. I had to go around all kinds of different routes to find a way. This was the only way left. Turn right on Railroad Avenue. And it looks like the water is quickly approaching 